Hello and welcome to Technology Simplicity YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to list all your files or perhaps certain files uh, in your Google Drive. After listing it and each of the items, you can have the individual download link. Yes, you want that right? Because sometimes you want to share a lot of files but you're lazy to you know, right click one by one, you know, share this link, share this link. You will just want everything at once. And perhaps I'm sharing with you the easiest way as well as utilizing the Google ecosystem which is Eco, uh, Google Sheet plus one of the great extension that I found it very very useful. I've been using it for quite some time. So let me share with you. Okay, well, if you have a Google Drive with a folder that you wanted to list out all your files and each items with each download link and listing down using a Google Sheet with an automated list down everything, I'm going to show you this guy. Okay, let's go. Sorry. Okay, first of all, let's say you have a folder, okay, that you have all the files that you wanna, okay, let's say it's here, okay, that's cool. So, and that, the first thing is, go to this guy, okay, it's called Drive Explorer, okay, the the link to this, this uh, is called Google Workspace uh, extension, yeah, they keep changing name, eh? <laughs> yeah, it's for me, it's a, like extension or add-on, so do your Google shit. So, you come to this guy, uh, of course, uh, log in your, your account first then just install it okay give the permission and they will actually ask for you for your permission to actually access your drive but don't worry they are not actually stealing your file they actually want to process your files okay so just click allow and sign in once you're done you already associate your account with this extension called drive explorer okay when it's done just click done so the next thing is go to your Google Drive. For me, I will just create a Google new sh a Google sheet, a new one. Okay, I'm gonna call it uh, demo listing all files from folder. Okay, that's for example. Okay, let me let me zoom in uh, so that you can see clearer. Uh, zoom in here. Okay, cool. Remember just now we already installed that extensions. So right now you just click extension here. You shall see the guy called Drive Explorer. Okay, if you see this guy is very simple, you just go to start export. Okay, just click it and give it a wow because it's yeah, okay. They actually wanted you to uh, check out the documentation as well as okay. The main data is only nine, but for me, I'm fine. Okay, I'm going to if you want to list out all the files in your Google Drive, you can click all files, but Okay, it might take a very very long time if a Google Drive have a lot of files. So for me, I'm just trying to select the items. I'm gonna click here. It will go you to show you the folders you have here. Okay, but right now you don't have anything because you haven't selected and put it to this extension. It's fine. Just click add items. Okay, give it the files and then it will actually ask you to pick the files in folders okay so the picker which default show you 50 files or folder at a time so if your google drive has a lot of folders and files don't worry okay you can search away and so on okay okay for me i don't want to show it anymore okay then i will start picking it so let's say i have this folder I, yeah i already i did purposely created it for this demo purpose okay i select this folder okay when it's done I have this so I need to include deeply nested files okay what is called nested files or folders imagine this folder called demo of, of list or files and inside the folder I got another folder so that is called nested folder for now I didn't show that uh, okay but still include it okay when it's done I will click export details so it will list your files and just don't close this dialog voila surprising it's done okay so if you look at it here you have the file name okay which is based on your file name you already know you have this and the best part is you have this call direct link 
You know what is direct ring, right? Okay, let's say I copy this guy. I open it in connector and paste the link. Direct link means you can download it. However, you need to log in. Okay, it's fine. How about this? Let me copy this guy. I open it again. Okay. See, the good thing about you after you have the link is everything is protected, which is for yourself only. So let's say you want to share with public. So what you can do is go to your folder, right click this guy, share. When you click share, let's say you want to open for everyone to view it. Okay, you can change it to uh, everyone with the link. Yep. public link ready done okay select all these guys select all and I'm going to click share okay the permissions is will work everyone with the link and view okay so this is actually how you make it um, public so when it's done okay so now you want to make it uh, the files okay Let's see, yeah. You see this guy? Can be downloaded already. Okay, if you that is download link. If you want to view the file, you click this guy called file link. Now you open it. It should be view. Okay, it take a little bit of time, still do it. Okay, this is depends on your internet connection and something like that. By the way, it's done. Yeah, look at the details, it's here. Yep. Simple, right? Using a simple Google um, Workplace extensions, okay, from the marketplace, and utilizing the power of Google Sheet and Google Drive, you can do a lot of amazing things. So I already show you how to list all your files from one specific folder, or perhaps there are many many subfolders inside, by using the power of the extension called Drive Explorer. Okay, the download link and the access link will be available in the video description. Feel free to browse around. So if you really enjoyed this video and you feel like you learned something and this is great, please do me a favor. Please like this video over here. Like this video as well as subscribe to my video. Okay, as well as put a ring up here. <laughs> put a ring so that you will get notified whenever I upload such a great video. And of course, don't forget to share to your friends. Um, you know, sharing is caring. Okay, thank you so much for watching. This is Technology Simplicity YouTube channel by Jay Chung. And hope to see you again. And most importantly, stay home, stay safe. Goodbye.